you guys. Here are my week eight predictions for this NFL season. Starting off, we got the Thursday night game. We have the two and four Jacksonville Jaguars at the three and four Tennessee Titans. I'm gonna pick the Tennessee Titans to win this game, 27 to 24. For the Sunday games, starting off with the four and three Washington Redskins versus the three and four Cincinnati Bengals. This game is in London, so I'm going to pick the Redskins since they're closer and they have less of a trip. I really think that uh, it does affect the teams, so the Redskins will play a little bit better. Final score, 2017. The 4-2 Kansas City Chiefs are at the 3-4 and four Indianapolis Colts. I'm going to pick the Kansas City Chiefs in this one. They're just a better all-around team, so I don't think... Uh, Andrew Luck will be able to carry the Colts in this one. So, final score, 24-21, Kansas City Chiefs win. The 3-3-1 three, three Arizona Cardinals are at the 1-5 Carolina Panthers. The Panthers don't look good at all this year, whereas the Arizona Cardinals are rebounding off a slow start. So, I'm going to give this one to the Cardinals. Final score, 31-27. The 5-2 Oakland Raiders are headed to Tampa Bay to face the 3-3 three three Tampa Bay Buccaneers. I'm going to give this one to the Raiders. They got a high-powered offense, and I don't think the Buccaneers will be able to keep up. So final score, 34-24. The 4-1-1 Seattle Seahawks are at the 2-4 and four New Orleans Saints. This will be my upset of the week. I'm picking the New Orleans Saints to win this game. Drew Brees performs really well when he's at home. And the Seattle Seahawks are struggling on offense. And I don't think uh, their defense will be able to slow the Saints offense down enough for them to keep up. So final score... 27-17. The 4-3 Detroit Lions are at the 4-3 Houston Texans. I'm going to give this one to the Texans. Final score, 17-14. The 6-1 New England Patriots are at the 4-3 Buffalo Bills. Even though the Buffalo Bills are the only team to defeat the New England Patriots, they did that with... A out Tom Brady playing. So now that Tom Brady is playing, I'm going to give this one to the New England Patriots. Final score, 28-27. The 2-5 and five New York Jets are at the 0-7 Cleveland Browns. Ryan Fitzpatrick has been playing on a chip with, on his shoulder ever since he got benched for Geno Smith. Geno Smith is out for the year with an ACL tear. And I think uh, Ryan Fitzpatrick will start to improve, especially against this Cleveland Browns defense. Final score, New York Jets 24, Cleveland Browns 17. The 3-4 and four San Diego Chargers are at the 5-2 and two Denver Broncos. I don't see uh, the San Diego Chargers pulling up at, off another upset against their division rival Broncos. So I'm giving this one to the Broncos, 24-20. The 4-2 and two Green Bay Packers are at the 4-3 and three Atlanta Falcons. It's starting to look like uh, the same as it did last year for the Atlanta Falcons, a strong start, and then they start to slide off. So I'm giving this one to the Packers. Final score, 27-20. For the Saturday night game, we have the battle of the rookie quarterbacks. The 4-2 Philadelphia Eagles are at the 5-1 Dallas Cowboys. I'm going to say the Philadelphia Eagles are going to win this one. I think Carson Wentz is the better quarterback, even though the Dallas Cowboys have the better team overall. I'm still giving this one the Eagles. Final score, 30-27.
for the Monday night game, we have the 5 and 1 Minnesota Vikings at the 1 and 6 Chicago Bears. This is my lock of the week. The Vikings are going to win this game, although I do think the Bears are going to keep it competitive. Final score 24 20. And that will wrap up my picks for this week. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe.